What's up guys? Welcome to another rough vlog. Today I got my buddy Wes with me. Wes has uh Morning. hasn't made it into a rough vlog yet. I don't know how. We fish too much together. We just we always get concentrated on fish. And then we start at noon. Yeah. So Wes is an original noon patroller. Yes. Maybe we'll end up that way today. <laughs> yeah, so far today has been like a day of complete failures. I was in charge of getting tacos. My favorite taco shops closed on Mondays, which I just learned. And I learned it too late to make my own tacos. So I made Wes get us tacos. And then, what else did we mess up? I don't know, we're just moving really slow this morning. But sun's out, wind's low. It's about the only day this week where the weather is decent enough for us to get on the water. So we're gonna go chase, we're gonna go try some spots that I haven't, haven't normally fished this time of year and uh, see, see what the redfish are up to out there. Nice work. All right, we got first fish in the boat. So this morning it's a little chilly and the water's super low. So we're basically focusing our efforts right now on the outside. We got some beautiful sand flats that we're pulling along. That fish just came up out of nowhere. I didn't, did you sight cast him? I saw him, he looked at it and then I didn't see him. And then you and I were talking and I looked back down and I was like, oh shit, he's chasing it. It's like, well, there he is. He wasn't super enthusiastic to start with. I don't think he knew what happened to him. Kind of sipped it. And yeah. then, he, then he realized that he's hooked. And then he was just like, oh, this isn't fun. This is not what I wanted to do today. This, this was not what I thought that crab was going to do. Let's do it again. Yeah, I like it. Nice red. Two in the boat. Only 947. Man, we were in like... I don't know, hundreds of them right there. Oh my goodness, there's like 20 of them. We'll catch one. <laughs> I think those dolphins are helping us a little bit, keeping them up here on the flats a little bit. Let's keep going, and I'm liking this. You know you're having a good day when you catch a dink and you're like, ah. All right, so we got out of the fish a little bit, kind of ran into another guy that was working that same shoreline. Tried a little creek, had no water in it. We're gonna reposition and try a different little section of shoreline. Weather today is so good. I can't believe it's February right now. It's another day here on the Texas coast. Yep. Yeah. Number six in the boat. Three nice little ones. That one had a little more size to them. Yeah. Dude, this is definitely the move for today. I'm pretty pumped about, you know, you put together a game plan. You hope it works and we pretty much stuck to that game plan so far all day today and 
it's been the move. Going for a little fly change real quick. I've been using this little crab pattern, but as much as these fish are on the move, it's not really, they're not really looking down right now. So what we want to do is get something that's got a little bit more tail to it, a little more bait fishy. And something with a little bit of weight so it'll get down a little quicker. There's a bunch of fish moving right now. There's two right in front of you too. Alright, so we're going to our second fly change of the day. Why did we switch? Because I had four fish look at it. And they didn't want it. That's just straight up rejection. I don't really do well with rejection. What are we going with? And I'm tying on just a coyote clouser. Something that I've had pretty good luck with. So we'll see what happens. I don't think that uh, being the sandy bottom that we're in right now, that black was the ticket. Although I liked, I liked being able to see it. Well, we got in some dirtier water, so I thought it might be the move too. I thought so too, but they obviously were not into it. When you drag it across their nose and they turn their head, it's not what you want. For a second, I thought it was just kind of the dolphins out on the outer edge that were spooking them, but if that were the case, we wouldn't have caught any earlier. It's been a pretty uh, interesting thing that when the dolphins aren't here, we're not catching fish, but when the dolphins are here, we're catching fish. So yeah, we'll see. If they don't, if they don't want this. Then... We've got options. Or they just don't want anything. There we go. Fly change worked out. Right, there's one right there tailing. The dolphins are back, caught a fish. once they fucking tail it, like yeah, chase it. They ain't fucking doing it, man. Did he? So many redfish. Oh. There he is. <laughs> so many sitting underneath us right now. Check out that little guy. That's a nice one. Snacks. Look at those pr pickles. <laughs> okay, I have one, dude. They're fucking delicious. Hold on. Woo! That was a day. Man, I think we saw well around 200 plus fish today. What a day. Can't ask for better weather. Can't ask to see more fish. I don't know how many we put in the boat often. When I get home, I'll have to, when I'm editing, I'll probably figure it out, but I actually won't. Yeah, I'll be honest, matter. I'm not going to count it. <laughs> Nobody cares. Do we, yeah, Wes, man, I'm glad that you were able to come down yeah, to the coast. I'm glad that you weren't out of sea yet and we got to do it, man. It's been a while. Oh, yeah. Five months. Five months. Long. Yeah, Wes hasn't caught a redfish in five months. I hadn't seen you. I hadn't fucking seen my you or been on my boat or <laughs> hadn't done anything. So, it's good to, good to get out, man. I feel recharged. 
Now I just gotta wait another five months. <laughs> no. Alright, if you guys haven't, I'm gonna leave some links down below. Check out Wes's Instagram, Onion Creek Fly Co. I'll also leave a link to his website. He uh, hand makes all his own flies, sells them. So anything you want, Wes can do it. Pretty much. Pretty much. I don't, I don't do dry, fry, dry flies or nymphs. No dry flies or nymphs. <laughs> And as always, hit like, hit subscribe, all that stuff helps me out. Thank you guys. Hope you enjoyed it.